Hi right, folks, how's it going? It's Des Catties, and in this video, what I want to do is do a quick one on um, basically sort of hygiene um, and simple toiletry kits and stuff like that. So stay tuned for another video. <laughs> To the woods and stuff like that or up in the hills or whatever it is you're doing how many of you actually ask the question to yourself how many of you actually carry a, a, a basic hygiene kit now obviously you know if we're out maybe just for an overnighter yeah you can get you can kind of get away with it i think without actually um you know having to having to keep your body clean but if there's one thing i have to do if nothing else and that's brush my teeth um, normally uh, my hygiene kit if you like goes inside uh, one of these little pouches obviously for Mr Fryers um, and what else what I tend to do is I tend to carry two handkerchiefs one in each pocket now in my left pocket I normally have a snot rag this is the one that I blow my nose with and then normally this one is normally the one that I may use just to sort of dry off some of the moisture of some of my cooking equipment or stuff like that all right now the only other bits of kit that I take in my in my um, toiletry kit, if you like, if I just pan the camera down, is this. All right. Now I don't always do it, but the first thing I want to show you is these wipes. These are Epic wipes, and uh, these are just a lot of like you know you open them up, and they're a, a full body um, wipe. Okay, great bit of kit they are. They're very compact. I bought these from a company here in the UK. Um, and they are great, great to use. Um, but some people don't like using wipes because they still feel dirty and clammy and everything else in them. But I can quite categorically say that these are really good wipes, these ones, okay? But I'm not affiliated with Epic Wipes, all right? These are just something that I'm suggesting, all right? Now, other than that, the, this is basically my, my toiletry kit. You know, this will, you know, this will last me a good few days. You know, about a week. You know, if I don't worry about shaving, I don't carry, um, I don't carry uh, a razor, and I don't carry shaving cream or anything like that. But what I do, oh, there's a little insect there crawling around. But what I do, obviously, carry is um, these items. Now, the first one, which I bought quite recently, was some Burt's Bees, and this is basically just like a, like a honey-based um, sort of what you want to call it an ointment of sorts and um, if you're like me one thing that I do suffer with when I'm out for a few days is that I sometimes get um, little splits around my nails and stuff like that whether it's because my hat my skin's drying out and stuff like that so what I've been using of, of late and it's been helping is literally just wiping a bit of that over my nails <coughs> and it's preventing the sort of you know the broken bits of skin that you get around your fingernails all right so I'll carry a tin of that like I said, okay, if there's one thing I have to do is brush my teeth. Yeah, there's a million and one different type of um, toothbrushes out there, but the one I tend to use is just one of these little fold away ones, okay? And then what I do then, obviously, with the fold away toothbrush, I, I normally carry these little little travel sort of um, uh, tubes of toothpaste. You can pick these up either from, you know, your local super, uh, supermarkets and, and discount shops and stuff like that, or I have actually picked some up from the dentist as well. So again, obviously, the, um, you know, the old... Uh, the old toothbrush and toothpaste, you know, very important. You know, you know, if you, uh, you know, you've got to keep your breath smelling nice, and obviously your teeth feeling clean. There's nothing worse. I normally just brush my teeth once, and that's in the mornings, um, and then that's enough for me. Some people like to brush their teeth twice a day, but again, that's up to you. Um, the next thing I carry is some um, this super wash, body wash, if you like, wilderness wash, whatever you want to call it, and. Um, this particular one is from Sea to Summit. Um, what I like about using these kind of super concentrated ones, you can get powders and all sorts, but I'm not really keen on them. But using this super concentrated stuff, it's biodegradable, multi-purpose. Obviously, it's concentrated as well. And the good thing about this, not only not only do I need it for, um, not only do I. Do I need to be able to use it with uh, on my body? I can use it if I if I so wish to obviously clean stuff as well, like my dishes and pots and things like that. If I get a bit desperate, also with this you can use it with salt water. 
Um, and, and then also for cleaning your clothes as well. So it's obviously a little bit of a, uh, a multi-purpose kind of, um, you know, sort of, sh um, sort of uh, lotion, if you like, rather than just using um, sort of like a body wash on its own. Another thing I like to carry as well is some cocoa butter. This is great for, for putting on your, lip, on your lips and also it, it just softens um, dry skin. Yeah, I, I really like to sort of um, keep things that are, you know, for my na uh, for, for around my, you know, my hands are not manicured, you know, but um, I certainly like to keep stuff like that because obviously when you're out, if your hands are getting wet, getting cold, and all the rest of it, and you start getting all these splits, as I say, around your nails and stuff like that, it becomes quite uncomfortable. So I like to take that. Leading on, then I have a pair of nail clippers. Oh. Well, I never. Well, that's just pinged out of there. I've got no reason why. Um, I was going to say you need a good quality set of um, nail clippers, and I'd like to think that these are, but for some reason they've uh, the clip bit has it's come out the clip bit there. Oh, darn! What, what, what can I say? Oh, I don't know what I've done there, then, folks. I'll have to just bear with me a second. Oh, there's nothing like having it real, is there? But anyway, a set of nail clippers. Okay, either for your toenails, because the last thing you want, you know, you're walking on your feet all day. Um, so it makes sense to have a good set of uh, to have a nice set of nail clippers. Obviously, ensuring that you know pre-planning and preparation when you are going out walking, you do that sort of admin at home before you go. But obviously, they're quite handy. I like to have these as well when you get the little overhang bits of skin. It's nice just to clip them back, and they obviously stop they stop snagging on everything. So I set of nail clippers. Okay, another bit for oral hygiene. I like to carry a few um, a few dental floss. Items and these are just like little plastic ones, um, you know, that I've picked up from a from a from a, like a bargain shop. Um, you can ping that out there, and it says nice little toothpick there to get all the debris out between your teeth. And then also you've got that one there, which has obviously got like a minted fragrance on it. All right, so that works sweet as well. So I keep two or three of them on there. I mean, obviously, if I was going out for longer, I might take a few more. And then finally, what I've got in there is a just a simple little handkerchief, uh, handkerchief, a little flannel. And I basically use the flannel just as a means of um, obviously drying my hands and stuff like that, drying my face off, um, using it on my body. Yeah, I'd let my if I was to dip my body in a lake or a stream or something like that, then yeah, I would try and let my body, depending on obviously how cold it is, I would use this. this this holds quite a lot of moisture this particular um, sort of flannel anyway so I can use it in a dabbing motion just to sort of dry my body stand near the fire and dry myself off totally smelling like a smelling like a like a nice smoked burger or something like that and then all them items okay bar the um, bar the epix wipes go inside my uh, inside this little pouch here okay so that all fits in there nice okay Anything else you want to put in there is totally up to you. Some people like to carry a comb. Obviously, if you've got a beard, you might want to carry a beard comb or a beard brush and stuff like that. When I was, when I did have my my, uh, my beard, I was carrying a, a little fold away um, sort of comb that I was using on my face. Okay, Rose is clicking around there. Okay, and then that's that there, and then that just then fits into one of my external pouches on my rucksack, and um, and there it is, just a nice, simple, um, basic, simple hygiene, toiletry kit, whatever you want to call it. All right, um, so we've got that, got the two handkerchiefs, as I say, the red one I use for bogeys, the right one I use just for cleaning up moisture, and then obviously if I'm out a bit longer, then maybe I'll take a couple of these epic wipes. All right. So there it is folks, all right, so thanks for watching. Please leave your comments down below. All right, if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do so, sort of just, what is it, sub, uh, sub, give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, I don't really care. And then finally share my video videos if you so wish. Please check out the description. I've had some people asking about certain things in past videos. Check out the description. I try to put some information in the description with links. It, I'm only human, so I might forget certain things. But if I do, obviously, please let me know. And then I'll obviously add them to the description. All right. So Desk signing out and I'll see you on the next video.